Hi everybody! Welcome back to Love Sweets, Episode 2. And in this game so far, we see some level of social pressure with our main character Itsuki. So in Episode 1, you remember the time we tried to hang out with friends, but his friends were not interested because they now have girlfriends to take care of. It's because they all took part-time jobs last spring and Itsuki mentioned that he was too busy with housework and couldn't do so. So now he misses out on his opportunity and when the friends were talking about topics and subjects it was always related to dating, romance, how to take care of a girlfriend. Things that Itsuki can connect to. And then when they see this girl named Kunai Otonashi walked down the hallway, his friends mentioned, Hey, I'm Itsuki. If you really want a girlfriend, you can ask her out because I'm pretty sure she's open. And then Itsuki just shut them down and his friends conclude that, yeah, Itsuki's too far behind. But anyways, let's see what happens next. Okay, so let's see. I immediately fought back and the tension fell a bit. Uh, well that today is a girl. Hmm. Oh, that's it. So Yui's kind of asking so Yui's asking Itsuki, what is it? So I think um, he's bringing all this question, like um, he's acting suspicious, he's kind of thinking about something, and Yui notices it. I guess I'm going to get a part-time job too. Oh, okay. Hmm. So Yui um, tries to, to digest what Itsuki just said. Oh, you want a part-time job? Yep, a part-time job. So Yui kind of seems surprised about what um, I just said and she was squeezing the crocket in her hand. Hmm, such thing as an experience for me who cries until I look back. There's no problem with money. In the first place, there was no way to spend so much money. So he kind of feels like, well, maybe I need to get a part-time job too and see what the, what my friends are up to or see all the things that um my friends were able to learn that I didn't learn, or I felt, or I was left out. So he was like, why all of a sudden? Why all of a sudden? Ah, uh, well there's various things, like um, the fall of the yen. I'm not sure if he's telling the truth. Oh yeah, that's right. So because the gen has depreciated, I need more of it to survive. But you know, Itsuki, you haven't really done much of that until now. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So now Yui is asking him, why? Um, I think Yui knows that um, Itsuki is lying about the reason I want a part-time job is because um, the yen has depreciated or the currency has depreciated and I need more of it to survive. So especially when um, it was all of a sudden he just out of the blue, 
I want a part-time job. So Yui's like, um, there's no such reason to start suddenly. Yeah, that's right. Uh, why? Um, because a friend made her uh, at a part-time work destination. I work part-time too. It's begun. So the idea that um, well, when my friend worked at a part-time job, um, he was able to get a girlfriend, and they were able to become a couple. As I cannot say anything like that, I, I decide to explore with such words. So he's kind of hiding the real reason from Yui and coming up with all sorts of um, ways to. Um, or he just finds some excuse that um, Yui's gonna take. Hmm, well, I just want to learn more about social life. Or um, learn about what real life is like outside of school. Huh? Hmm? So Yui is still questioning Itsuki. <laughs> so Yui's like, um, well, don't try to be silent about it. Don't try to be silent about it. Well, I know it's been two years, and I believe it's time for me to move on as well. So I thought this is the best time to um, transition. Well, I seem to be caught, but I try to act as if I didn't notice it. It may be pretty it may be pretty perceived that it is trying to start a part-time job with motivation for wickedness or maybe perceived or have a devious motive. Around this year my friends who just played around without any purpose um got girlfriend Got a girlfriend during the spring vacation. I did not mind at first, but as I thought, my friends were taken by a thief cat. So it's like, uh, maybe they just want to do a part-time job and Itsuki's like, well, oh well, they can do that, I can do this. But then they see, like, oh, but when he took the part-time job, he got all these benefits, all these um, positive experiences that um he missed out on I'm left behind youth I'm in danger I do not want to think of finishing school without leaving anything like this if the guys were able to make girlfriends while being part-time employees it can happen to me too. It may be a too honest idea, but if you do not act while your motivation is high, it will definitely be too late. So it's like, um, well, it's a good chance. Um, I may never get this chance again. Or maybe the fact that um, the later, the more I wait, the farther I'll be behind. I lost my friends. Oh no, since my relationship with my friends got worse, I have to stand up. It would be natural to have one or two of such desires, um, the desire to date with girls, cute ones. And it's good to add some color into a boring school life. 
Ah, so um, where do you want to work? Uh, you want to work at a cafe or some other place like that? Hmm, so why do I have to hear your opinion? Maybe Yui has some ideas or she knows some places that might be suited for Itsuki? Oh, um, when there's an acquaintance, um, or when I show up, maybe you can give me some service and show me what it's like. Or, like, I can maybe see how you serve me. Uh, everyone says to everyone. Ah, this, these store and tea are also a wonderful good one. But, however, I feel awkward in visiting at such as it isn't put in. Ah, yeah, because I am. It's so spiritual to drink afternoon tea in the, at a cafe and pinch sweets and bloom at the Girls Association. So, so. Oh yeah! I'll be happy if um, I went to a shop and I got treated very gently by a gentleman. Thinks um, Yui. Oh no, um, no, who's yours? So you was like, um, what's going on? Wait a second, um, it's an ant. So he finds this place called, um, Hot Chocolate. And it's attractive, so he thinks... So he thinks um, this cafe was um, what got Yui to think that, Oh, um, if you want a part-time job, you should work at a cafe. I think this kind of inspired her to say that. I thought it was a shop without a fringe. But I guess this kind of store can achieve my purpose as well. And maybe it might make Yui happy because um, Oh yeah, you were working at a cafe. And there seems to be many cute, cho cute children in there. So do you want this place? Or do you want to work at this place? Well, I don't know yet. Oh, I know this place. It's popular for girls. Really? Wow. Even people working are talking about the fact that there's... The only guy in there is the, um... Is the master or the shop owner. What we should you call the um, the master chef? Hey, look at this, Yui. So, um, as he looks closer at the shop, he finds a piece of paper. I think it's posted on the door or the window. So it's a piece of paper that's talking about, um. A job posting. And for some reason it's handwritten. And I think it's probably been on the window or the door for many weeks because um now the writing is starting to fade because of the weather. And it looks like um it was written in pencil. So I'm not really sure why um the master chef wants to hire people this way, because um Unless someone happens to walk by the shop, no one's going to know that this place is looking for extra um, help.
Hey, look, um, they're looking for a guy. Oh, um, I'm gonna apply as soon as I decide. Ah, uh, feels. Fate doesn't feel. She was like, um, hmm. Why would Itsuki want this place? Um, and she's trying to analyze what Itsuki just said. And Itsuki's like, what are you thinking about? Oh, so you want to work in a place being surrounded by girls, don't you? Uh, no, 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 uh, not something like that. Such, it's invisible and whether you have that. Oh. A strange gaze hurts a burning. So I'm pretty sh I'm thinking that um Yui's maybe pointing out what Itsuki really wants. And I think he wants a girlfriend. Well, he does want a girlfriend and he's trying to hide it from Yui, but um the way or his actions lead Yui to, to suspect this. Oh, it's a work at home place. It's kind of cozy. So they're going, well, this place kind of makes you feel at home. Oh. Yeah. Hmm, it has good pay. Oh. Okay. Uh, well, it's kind of okay, isn't it? Oh. Yeah, I think it's good. But. She was like, um, so, um, you really want to work at this place then? So, um, one, comfortable environment, two, good pay, three, um, the fact that, it, um, he can be like, no, um, he's the, they need more, a uh, man e effort. Um, what? Oh, but you know, um, Iori is also here. Well, Iori will tell you if you talk. Well, then again, um, I don't think my sister will know that I'm gonna start a part time job at this place. And then I'll just return home late, and then she won't notice. In the first place, it was decided that I can still work. So I wonder what his sister has to do with um, this, this conversation. So I go, well, um, your sister is working here. And I'm not really sure what kind of implications it's going to bring. So, um, it looks like, um, Itsuki is gonna get the contact information for this place. Uh, I wish Itsuki would be nice. Okay, so let's continue here. So, um, Itsuki, um, he wants a part-time job. And you suggest the cafe. And there happens to be a cafe nearby. It's all bright and shiny. And they're actually looking for someone. Which is a kind of a rare opportunity. Well, things like this don't happen smoothly all the time. But either way, I'm, I'm going to work here. Or I'm going to apply for this place. And now he's returning home.
Well, it can be helped. Well, let's get dressed. I've been walking for at least two hours. So you give me chocolate to help you recover your physical strength? Ah, uh, the physical strength that I can recover with a 1 5 yen chocolate is insignificant. Um, well, boys need more fuel to recover their strength. So, um, as a result, he's eating all these crockets because they have lots of fat, which means lots of calories for him to burn. Well, then again, um, fat calories are really hard to burn and they're not recommended as compared to the sugars or the starch carbohydrates. Uh, it seems to be my age when my stomach is anxious, but I could not put it out after all. So yeah, I need more food, I need more fuel, I get hungry easily. Okay, so I'm sorry I talked over... So you was like, okay, well I'll leave soon. Oh yes, um... I got a good greeting, but um, why are you, are you eating it because it's special? Um, I'm not really sure what she means. Well actually I was doing it in the morning. If it's been a little more, season will be too long so I have to eat it now. I'm not sure if he's just coming up with some good justification about why he's eating all those crockets like um oh well I made it fresh in the morning and um if I don't eat it now it's gonna be spoiled so might as well just eat it up before instead of letting it spoil and I have to throw it out ah <sighs> well I like the troublesome things surprisingly don't you think Yeah, I live together with my sister, and I have to do all the housework. So that's why um, Itsuki wasn't able to get a part-time job like his friends were, because um, he's taking care of the house. I'm not really sure where his parents are, but it's just him and his sister alone. And because his sister is at a part-time job, or working at um, Hot Chocolate, he has to take care of the house. But uh, I've been doing this for uh, quite some time, so it's not much of a worry. So he's kind of used to it. Hmm. Delicious boiled onion. Delicious. If I say so to there, will you treat? It's a reason why it's better to have as many people as possible to consume while buying foods too much. Okay, well, let's get inside. Yeah, I think uh, um, we should just get inside before it's too late. Hmm, it seems that Inoue is unusual today. Apparently she's taking a shower. So I wonder if um, Yori um, had to work overtime or um, because um, there were so many people. Um, recently I've been worried because um, I wonder if it's him or um, Yori that's been coming home late. But it's like um, one of us has been coming home late, and even if I consult Yui, um, I'll be made down. So maybe the fact that um, Yui's not going to give good advice about what's happening. Uh, 
Um, I see. My sister, who just entered school, hasn't been involved in any bad things. And that's kind of a worrying point. But Eri says it's okay, and I believe that I'll take care of my older brother. Well, Iski is kind of overprotective. Eri isn't the child who does such a thing. So I think um, Iski is really worried about his sister Yori and. He um, is a protective of her and does a lot of things that um, should be best left alone and let for Yuri to explore. And Yuri's like, well, you shouldn't be worrying about Yuri too much because she's growing up as well and she knows what's right and what's wrong and she should have some freedom in making her judgment. <laughs> So, um, what's the reason for um you starting a part-time job? Maybe because you want to see what Yuri is doing at work and monitor her? Um, also known as SISCON. Well, why would you bring that word up? If you say something like that, it'd be quite messy. I won't add ginger- I won't add ginger to be boiled by- with sauce. Nothing much. Well, I don't seem interested in ginger. I sat on the sofa and opened a magazine that I had at hand. Ah, <sighs> yeah, I'm kind of lonely. The fact that I don't have my old friends to hang out with. I'm kind of alone now. However, it is now that one Yui is playing. Yeah, I'm lonely, I'm lonely. So it looks like a Miyori has come out of the showers. He's like, um, oh, um, Nissan, welcome back. It was my younger sister's voice that, um, broke the conversation between me and Yui. So she seems to have gone up from the bath before getting in. Okay now. Uh you um you sister, um you're welcome. Okay, what's going on? So did she faint? So, I'm not sure what's wrong with Yuri. Um, the moment Yui saw Yuri, she fainted. Maybe there's something wrong about. Oh, Nissan, I ran out of conditioner. Okay, so she just came out of the um, bath with just a towel and she's telling. It's key. Oh, um, I ran out of conditioner, so um, can you help me get some? And this is where I'm gonna stop for now. And we're gonna see more of the interaction between Itsuki and Yuri. Maybe we might have some idea of how Yuri feels about Itsuki getting a part-time job. Just to be up to social norms with um, his friends and to get a girlfriend like his friends did with their part-time jobs. With that in mind, I'll see you in the next episode.